Hello everyone, this is Blood Queen Tarot and I am here to do a reading for water signs. Water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Um, I'm doing this reading for today and tomorrow, so March the 29th and the 30th. Um, water signs, please keep in mind that the reading, it may or may not resonate with you. Some parts of the reading might resonate, other parts of the reading might not. As well, keep in mind that time is fluid. So this reading can manifest between today and tomorrow. It can manifest later on down the line of time. Um, after tomorrow, or well, this present reading could be past energy for you. If this present reading is past energy for you, then there might be answers or closure for you in this present reading that pertains to your past situation or circumstance. So the um the words that I saw or the messages was um Jesus, Yeshua, honest. Um, we got told you so at the bottom of the deck. So what a sign. Somebody should listen to you or you need to listen to someone else between today and tomorrow. Because somebody is going to say, I told you. I told you so. Something to do with um, honesty or somebody is honest. Or something to do with Jesus, Yeshua. Something like that going on. But that's what I saw during the pre-shuffle. All right. So let me get y'all some messages for today and tomorrow. All right, they want to they want to take you out on a date. So what a sign! Somebody want to take you out to a, on a date. They, he, or she don't care. So somebody want to take somebody out on a date, and somebody don't care. You don't care. All right. Okay. So what a sign! You could be dealing with an ex. And you might find out that your ex is dating somebody new. And um, what are signs you don't care and your ex don't care? Like your relationship could be over. Or somebody's dating somebody's crush or something. And um, somebody don't care. No, what are signs someone wants to take you out on a date. And it could be your ex that don't care. So what are signs you might go on a date with somebody new or whoever. And your ex might find out about it. And what are signs you don't care and your ex don't neither. So what are signs you and your ex could have an open relationship or your ex um, has emotionally detached. It's like they don't care. Or what are signs your ex don't care that you're going out on a date because your ex is aware that you might run back to them or you're going to always be, be there or something like that. So what are signs here? Yeah. So water signs, it could be another water sign that might take you out on a date. It could be another water sign. They want to take you out on a date because you're a water sign or um, this person that want to take you out on a date, they're a water sign like you. So water signs, somebody don't care that someone likes you. So what it signs your ex is either over you, they're emotionally detached, or it's like what it signs your ex is very confident that um you're gonna always be theirs or you're gonna always go back to them or something like that. Ooh. Or what it signs something could be going on with your brother. Water signs, if you're a female or water signs, it don't matter. But your brother, water signs, is somebody that your brother was telling you not to date. And water signs, you're going to date this person anyway. And your brother is like, you know what? If water signs want to be hard-headed, then go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. Then we got blessed. So water signs, you don't care about somebody else's opinion. Or you're done with your ex because you're blessed. Yeah, what a sign. You, you know you're blessed. So what a sign. Either this is your um, ex-lover that's coming up in this energy or your brother. Or what a sign. You could be somebody's brother or you're dealing with, with your brother. And your brother was telling you not to date someone. And you might date this person anyway. All right. So we have told you so. Yeah. So
So what is signs? Whatever your ex know about this person you going out on a date with, or whatever your brother know or was trying to tell you about this person you're going out on a date with, it might actually happen. And what are signs your ex or your brother gonna say, I told you, told you so, or something like that. Yeah, listen. So what are signs? I don't know if you're being hard-headed or not. So you could be being a little hard-headed or a little rebellious. <clears throat> or what are signs? Somebody don't like you because you don't listen. It's like somebody don't care. They, he, or she don't care that somebody like you. This person that want to take you out on a date, they like you because you're a good listener. Or what a signs this person that don't care about something? They like you more when you listen. Or the reason why this person is upset with you is because you're not listening to them. Or something like that. Yeah, we got hate. Yeah. So what a signs whether you're dealing with your ex or like your brother... Y'all have a love and hate relationship. Yeah. Y'all have a love hate relationship. Or what a sign your brother feel as though you deserve better. It's like what a sign you don't care because you know you blessed. But somebody hate hate that about you. It's like what a sign your brother is saying. If you know you so blessed, why are you dating someone? Um, that's inferior to you. Like something like that. Somebody saying. Or what a sign. Somebody was trying to tell you that somebody that want to date you, they're like your hater. So it's like, what a sign. Somebody know you're blessed and they hate that about you. And it could be the person that's asking you out on a date. Or something like that. Yeah. Somebody probably hate white people. Or it's a white person that hates someone. Or something like that could be going on. Yeah. Yeah, so what are the signs? I'm picking up. You could be between today and tomorrow. You might have a disagreement with an ex. This could be an energetic disagreement or a verbal disagreement. What are the signs you're going to have an energetic or some type of disagreement with an ex or a, a brother or someone who's like a brother to you? And what are the signs? I think what this person is trying to tell you is going to happen. And then this person is going to say, I told you so. Or somebody was lying about their birthday. Or what are signs? This person that wants to date you, they only want to date you because they feel as though you're a pushover or something. And somebody trying to tell you to stay away from somebody. And somebody only wants to date you or this person likes you because they feel as though you listen. You're a good listener or they feel as though you're going to submit to them or be gullible or something. So what are signs? I'm hearing if you don't listen to somebody, you're going to have to listen to somebody. Yeah, something like that. Or what are signs? You know somebody blessed. What are signs? You could be around somebody that's very intuitive and you don't care. You like someone. So what are signs? Say like you a female and your brother is saying, don't date him because he hits on women. Or what a sign somebody is saying don't it's like this person knows it intuitively. And your brother could be saying, Don't date so and so because he hits on women. I know I can look at him and tell he hits on women. And what a signs you like, well, we're gonna wait and see. We're gonna see. And what a signs you say you don't care, you going on a date with this man anyway. Yeah, and it's like your brother or your ex hate that about you. That you don't listen. 
or something. Or or what a sign somebody feels as though you listen to the wrong people or the wrong group of people wrong group of people. So what a sign you're the blessed one or this other person that's um trying to tell you not to do something, they're blessed. And I'm picking up this is their intuition. Somebody is blessed intuitively and they trying to tell you something. Yeah, something to do with the 5D, yeah. Somebody's very intuitive. And what it sounds, you probably hate somebody's intuition. Because this person always right or something like that. So what it sounds, that's the message that I have for you between today and tomorrow. So just be careful. Yeah. Or what it sounds, this person that's telling you not to do something, they could be hating on you. Or what it sounds, be careful because somebody could be warning you. So just be careful. Somebody could be warning you. Somebody could be prejudiced or. And this person say, if I see you dating my daughter, or I, I see you dating my son, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. And what it sounds, be careful because this person not playing around. It's like this person going to offend you and they're going to say, didn't I tell you I was going to offend you? Didn't I tell you that? Yeah, or something like that. So it could be a little racism going on. Whether y'all black or white, it could be some racism going on. Or some this could be something to do with the color white. Or the sign somebody could this don't have to be racism. This is race, this is white as far as um nationality or the color of something. So what a sign this could be something as simple as Somebody told you don't buy a white car or somebody said you're going out on a date. Don't wear white. And it's like, what are the signs? You're going to do it anyway. So this don't have to be racism, but it can be. And then it's at the bottom of the deck again. Yeah. So what a sign? Somebody was saying don't wear white. You shouldn't wear white or don't buy a white car. It's more expensive. Or, and what are the signs? You probably didn't listen or something like that. So, let me end it. So, that's what I have going on for you guys between today and tomorrow. And then we have sister and African. And then we have don't worry about it. So, let me just pull a message just to close out the reading. Let me pull a message. Give me a message to close out, a, to close out the reading. We have money and good health. All right. So what a signs? I think your money is going to be good. It could be telling me um, your money is in good health between today and tomorrow. What a sign? Your money could be in good health or you have money in good health. Or what a sign? It could be a lover that wants to use you for money. So just be mindful of that. This person knows that you have money and you're in good health or something. And somebody probably want to use you for money. Or something. Somebody could be trying to trying to warn you that somebody only wants you for your money. Or what a sign if you only using somebody for money, be careful about that. Because something might backfire. But nonetheless, what a sign I think this is for you. Your money could be in good health between today and tomorrow. Or you have money and good health. So, you know, you're going on a date. They want to take you out on a date and what are the signs you're going to say yeah. Because this person can have money. Or something like that. I'm hearing they smell good. This person smells good. Yeah, something like that. Going on. <clears throat> or what are the signs you might say you only live once. I'm in good health. I'm not staying in the house. I'm young. I'm single. I'm divorced. I'm not staying in the house. I got money. He got money. She got money. I got money. If they want to take me out on a date, I'm going. I'm in good health. There's no reason for me to stay in the house. Like something like that going on, water sign. All right. So let me end it. So again, this is Blood Queen Tarot and Water Signs. Um, enjoy your day and thanks.